Let's get right to it. I always get a laugh out of all the AI researchers who like to tell me they changed the world of analytics with faker science. The problem with that is it's a lie. Long before there were machine learning engineers or faker scientists, there were data experts in the real world doing the job. These professionals were called BI professionals or business intelligence developers. These roles still exist today. Most companies only have BI developers for all their data analytics. Guess what? There are no BI developers with PhDs. What does that tell you? Well, if you look at the job requirements on any of these roles, you can clearly see BI has always been the demand of the data professional. For a decade or more, if data professionals were doing all the data mining and BI work, how is it possible that the faker scientists and the machine learning engineers were such game changers? Right. Machine learning and faker science isn't much different than what BI professionals were doing right now. If all these roles were being done by data professionals called BI developers, why do you believe that someone outside of these roles has replaced them when that clearly isn't the case? The truth is, there's very little difference between a BI developer and a machine learning engineer. The truth is, the BI developer is actually more qualified than any of the academics. Why is that? Because if you know anything about the real world, you know that machine learning is data-centric. That means these BI professionals are far more skilled with data and data cleansing than anyone from academia. A little perspective about this is important. Data professionals did all the analytics before the faker scientists or the machine learning engineers even showed up. Head over to a job board and do some research on what BI developers do. It shouldn't take you that long to find out that it's almost identical to what machine learning engineers are doing. This is just another reason I hold little value with the people that have PhDs in this space. They have little to no real-world data experience, and the models being used have been around for a long time. By the way, as the faker scientist role and the machine learning engineering role continue to evolve into ML operations, who do you think is going to be creating all these pipelines? Right, the data professionals. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a great day.